candles, beer, and film. Three businesses that are expected to drive downtown Thomasville's economy forward in 2023. 2023, we're just holding out that it's going to be another great year for Thomasville. And with a new year comes new businesses opening up in the Rose City. Yeah, new at six, I got an inside look at what's just opened up and what's in the works in the months ahead. And it's not just a, a personal excitement or joy, it's, it's the community, it's the town, it's the city, it's the area. Maurice Jackson is brewing up something new for Thomasville. Hey, come say hello at Tavello. Tavello, a new brewing company setting up shop in the former Hubs and Hops storefronts. Uh, very surprised at how many people come up from Tallahassee as often as they do, and quite often just run right up Jackson Street and head to Broad. He's hoping to give people a reason to stop and enjoy the businesses on this busy street. He's no stranger to Florida either. I'm actually from San Antonio, Texas. I uh, made it to Florida State. Met a Florida girl. And when they open up, these 16 taps will be flowing with beer made right here in Thomasville. Around the corner. We sell a little bit of everything. Jordan Kimmel manages Blake Candle Company, a storefront that opened in the fall of 2022. We're right next door to Grassroots, so we keep that door open and it's just a constant flow in and out. A flow of new customers checking out hand poured candles made right in Thomasville. The shop hasn't escaped the impacts of inflation. We have had to change some of our prices. Um, in the past and in the present just because of the shipping costs, the supply costs, everything's just going up. But this Rose City native says she's proud to join the small business community here. They called it a, like our town could be in a Hallmark movie and to me that was like the biggest compliment. And Hollywood could be making a return to these streets in the new year. We have been told that Thomasville was selected to be the location. Bonnie Hayes is tourism director for Thomasville. While she couldn't tell me more details about the possible film productions in 2023, she says the movies have had a big impact here in recent memory. The very first film that we had, we know that we saw over $800,000 was put right back into the community. That film was Tiger Rising, shot back in 2019. In recent years, more movies have contributed to the downtown economy, including Sam and Kate, starring Dustin Hoffman in 2022, and One Way, starring Kevin Bacon. With more production, Hayes says production infrastructure could be in the works someday. We don't have the sound studios. We'd love to work towards that. As small businesses like Jackson's count on visitors from near and far to keep these streets bustling. The opportunity was here. Personally, extremely grateful for it.